What's up guys, Dark here and welcome to another episode of Let's Fix the Skyrim tutorial. So, as you can see I have Crash Fix uh, mod installed. Let's fix the crashes of the Skyrim, well most of them. Uh, but I still have crashes, um, some crashes I have, I get some crashes. Uh, I mean, it's probably because of mods. Uh, and uh, what you're gonna do is, first you have to like uh, check out what it sells you. And as you can see, if you have mod organizer, which I have, try adding force uh, stream, or um, you can uh, you can disable this warning from data. Uh, so I can disable the uh, the warning, and which I want is disabling the warning. Although, like default tip, uh, you can you can actually put it right there, and uh, you can actually fix it. I already have fixed it. I already put it. And as you can see, if I go to my task manager and my Garden folder, which you can go from here, and I go to the data, SKSA, SKSA .ini, and as you can see, I have heap alloc memory up to one or up to eight hundred. Although, what's the other thing you need to do if you want to disable this message, which I want to do? You can't just go into a plugins and add the folder right there. No, the actual place where the mod is active is through the mod organizer. Organize there, because uh, the mod that you add is uh, handled by this program. And uh, if you want to change it, you got to go to mods, find the mod that you want, which for me is a crash fix, which is the fixes the crashes and you go SKSA plugins and right there we have a crash fix plugin so you go here and you search for the patch and there you go warn SKSE memory patch and you just go to zero save and now let's see so this was the error message and now let's quit the game reopen the game and now check out if we get another message like that okay it's fixed so thanks so much for watching and if you want more tutorials like this leave a like subscribe i'm streaming the skyrim for like 10 hours and 12 hours very very long times thanks so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next episode or next video